Hello, everybody. My name is Florida Verm, and welcome back to the moon. I am so sorry to inform you that Oliver will not be joining us for a while because he is on summer vacation and unfortunately can't remember anything. Do you know what animal David's main morph is? I don't. What? What? I don't remember where we started off because where we end. No. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, that's correct, right? That doesn't sound right. Well, probably isn't right. Why are there multiple views? Do I have to click on stuff to figure this out? Is it going to make me look it up? Is that what's going to happen? Spacebar is the uh, talk key, right? No? Yes? No? Maybe so? Can't touch that guy. Welcome back to the moon, by the way. I'm pushing everything. Nothing is working. Okay. The last memory right there, and I don't know how to get it. Tobias, Hawk, Rachel, Grizzly, Jake, Tiger, Marco, Gorilla, David, Cobra, Cassie Wolf, why? I was just wondering. Could have just Googled it. Gonna go on a hunch here and say Gorilla. If I go all caps, will it work? Cobra! Oh yeah, Cobra. It worked! I really wish they kept the old covers instead of these plain sheets. Those were cool. Awesome. Can I leave? Hi, man. I'm all for going to the comic book store and all, but, you know. Where's the... What's the... Where's the way out? What's... What is the paradox here that I must attack? I can't run, so that pisses me off. Because I can't go... Oh, found it. Bloop. Power. Anxiety. Depression. Death. I don't know how that worked. Prepare the memento. Let's get going. So, yeah, for a while... Brit not Brittany. Holy crap. Oliver's not going to be with us because... Uh... Things are issues. I got this. We got this, guys. We got this. Yeah. We got this, girls and boys. Animorphs, activate. Let's get out of here. Oh, wait. I forgot. These are female male characters. I guess I ought to do some voices, huh? I'm a younger man now. Oh, well, he's a younger man now. Aw, everyone's leaving already? But I just got here. Seems to happen to you a lot at parties. I'll go save your childish jabs for the insecure. A glass of pickled olives. I see le fromage. But where's the mouse? That's the corniest remark you've made all night. Don't you mean cheesiest remark? Wow. <laughs> it's me! Okay. Where am I going? What am I doing? Who am I going? And who am I doing? I'm going to go up here. Because I don't know where I'm going. I can't run. I can't even go fast. I can't even be Sanic right now. Actually, let's not leave this area until we figure this out. I say as I'm already walking away. Because, you know, I'm slow as shit. That's a person. That's another person. That's a log. That's a person. I can't communicate with any of these people. Lean Sidget. I can't move. Shit. Let's go this way. Hey, person. Can't talk with you. Got it. Can't talk with you either. All right. Lovely. What was the point of me coming here again? This party sucks. None of the guests want to talk to me. I can't... Uh, 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 come on. Uh. Let's try going down. I can't go down. Let's go back up. And walk agonizingly slow as we're doing it. Almost there. 
Not, almost there. Almost there. We made it. I got another orb. I can't talk to anybody here. Oh, there we go. I started something. A memory. Do you feel any different? Now that we got these rings on, I mean... Oh, that's not him. That's not her. No. Damn it. Why do you? Actually, yeah, I think so. What is it like? It's just... different. Just the responsibilities, I suppose. Responsibilities. That's a big word. Do you like the name Anya? I think that, I think I think Oliver gave her a country accent. Would you like to name her Anya? Would you like to name her Anya? I understand. Yeah, Anya's a good name for her. Hey, come with me. Oh, they got married. That's what's going on. What time era does this take place? This can't be a good idea. I'll probably trip and fall. Don't worry. Just follow my steps. Aww. They're dancing. That's so cute. Ow, my ass. <laughs> ah. I think he stepped on my toes. Sorry. Come on, let's try again. And then they danced all night. That's what they were doing. They weren't making love or anything like that. They were dancing. To promise to love and comfort, to honor, and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. I do. And do you take this man standing before you to be your lawfully wedded husband? To promise to love and comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live? Yes. By the power invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you Mr. and Mrs. Wiles. River Wiles. John Wiles. River Wales. John Wales. We here now. Ah, the wedding. Uh, yeah. What did you think that was? I'm just bad at weddings, that's all. Fluids tend to escape from my eyes. I didn't know you were that sentimental. Oh, did I say my eyes? I meant my mouth. And by fluids, I meant both fluids and solids. That's a lovely in image. Thanks, Neil. Come on, let's find a way to get out of here. All this happiness and joy is really putting you off, too, huh? No. I just don't like watching people make mistakes. Sheesh. Whatever happened to just take it moment by moment? Talk to everyone. Click, 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 click. Maybe in her dress? No. Maybe in this guy's shirt? No. I can't even walk that way? What the fuck? What's blocking me? Alright, people, get out of my way! I'll walk right through your asses. Okay, I'm not afraid to do that. Let's go this way. Maybe there's more stuff down here. Who knows? I will know. That's everybody. Everybody's still here. Including this guy. Why is he important? I don't know. Maybe he's the grandfather. 
Oh, I'd better go see how your aunt is doing. Alright, Ma. Tell her thanks for coming. I will. I'm so proud of you, Joey. Name's not Joey, it's John. Joey? That's my grandpa's name. He passed away before I was born. Ma calls me by it as my nickname. How come you never told me about it? Because I'd rather you call me John. Ugh, not another sentimental grandparent childhood. What do you have against those, anyway? I mean, you sure talk about your grandfather a lot. But, oh, I got, them, I got them all wrong. What? No, I don't. Whatever you say. Joey. Wheeler. Joey Wheeler. Brooklyn Wade. I'm so proud of Joey. I'm sure you are, Grandma. I'm sure you are. Click everything that you can. Can't click hard enough. Not hard enough. God damn it. No, where else to go? Oh, wait, there's a place to go. Can't run or hide. Must walk the entire way. Car. I walked right through the car. Other car. I can't walk through this car. It's more solid than I thought. Other car. Third car. Fourth car. Fifth year car. I can't click any of it. Lovely. Where is the way out? That's a dog on the road. Maybe you guys should get off the road before things bad things happen. I'm just saying. It can't be helped, River. I'm sure they didn't mean to. Come on, we're late. Wait, is that a rabbit? I think this is the source of all those folded paper ones. Why would she obsess over some roadkill? Not to mention so many years later. Don't ask me. You are the woman here. I'll be convinced that I'm the only one when you do a cordless bungee jump. The rabbit's the key. I fucking knew it! One, two, three, four, five! Yay, I can count. <laughs> All right, let's see how you fix this puzzle here. Um, hmm. Hmm. Boop. 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 Hey! I did it. You know, it's a fantastic wedding when the mementos roadkill. Hey. Maybe she saw it as a metaphor for the terrible marriage. So years later, she began folding the rabbits because she was reminded of how rotten it was. Or, you know, something equally pretentious. Cool snorry, Neil. Cool snorry, really? That's when the story's too boring. Rabbit's still there. Poor thing. What's with all the road kills today? Don't you look like Don't you look at me like that? Smells like a farm and road kill. Deactivate the scent simulator or get away from here already. Why can't I run or walk fast? That's a horse. I'm holding down the shift button. It's not working. Why? Ah, bus! Oh, wait. It can't hurt me. That's a horse. And it's blue. Whoa! Don't do it. Don't do what? You know what. Do not ride this horse? What are you, five years old? 
Okay, I won't. I won't not ride it. Hiya! <laughs> Quit wasting time, Neil. Oh crap! That can't be good. Ah, do some. Don't just stand there. Help me! Damn it! This was not in the job description. We gotta go find Neil. Neil, you freaking more horses! Can't interact with them. There we go. Is that really a good idea? She should be okay. She's not new to this anymore. But she has never done it by herself before. I'll be fine. I'm not a child. Ah! Ah! River! Sounds about right. What's the matter? Let's go! Hey, wait up! Nay, motherfuckers! Nay! Huh! I wonder if Neil got off that horse yet. If, uh... Nope. This is about 19%. This is about 19% more than I can add all. What a moron. <sighs> Better go save his bum. Nay! Yes, I can move fast now. Finally! Where is, where is that? Where is that guy? There he is. Got him. And he's gone. Thanks. Ow. Hey, I found something here. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where are you, man? Me and Epona can't do everything. I mean, I'm sorry. His name is Seathitter. Memento found. Here. This will Memento do. This Memento will do. You'll have to line it up carefully with that horse, though. Don't look at me. I'm not getting on that beast again. Hey, right, well, I gotta friggin' find some mementos first. Let me see here. Uh, blah, 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 If I push spacebar enough, maybe it will lead me somewhere. Hey, more horses! Oh, give him more horses and that roadkill again. How do I get the orbs now? Now the orbs are getting harder to get. What's this orb doing hopping around? Acting like he's all special and shit. I got an idea. I can't do it. I was going to try and jump over it, but I couldn't do it. I need two more orbs, Neil. Better give me my shit. Or I swear to crapula. Nay! Nay! <laughs> Nay! I'm just mashing the space bar now. Can I not jump off the cliff? Is that what's going on? Horses! Try following her. Maybe she can lead me somewhere. And I lost her. Great job, me. Lovely. Where the... Where the hell did she go? Where did she go, lads? I don't know and I don't see... There she is. I'm gonna chase her. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. I got the other two orbs. And I'm stuck again. Lovely. Let's go. Onward. To Horsey Town. Oh, shit. Now it's getting more complicated. Um... <sighs> you know what, whatever, I got it done. I don't need to put it in the ideal mount. My tooth hurts. Now we're back in the 30s, apparently. Because everything's black and white. Is the diagnosis certain? Yes, we've reached a consensus on the result. Unfortunately, like many cases of pervasive development disorders, this is a rather late diagnosis. Had you known when you were a child, miss, it could have saved you a lot of trouble. Do you have any books on it? This one is by Tony Atwood. He's one of the specialists on the subject. You can borrow it free of charge for now. Just don't elope with it. Thanks, Doc. Now, are you two a couple? Unmarried and without any other current legal affiliation. Yes, I see. Well... I could give you a referral to a specialized counselor, if you wish. Is there anything unsettling in the relationship? No. And you, sir? No, it's fine. Nonetheless, sir, you should also give the book a read. It did help you understand her condition. I'd rather not. Why is that? Well, it's your call. In the meantime, there is a thing called equine therapy that might help her. A ranch just north of here offers it. I can contact them for you. I love horses. They gallop a lot. They neigh. Told you so. Okay, let's talk to everybody here. Excuse me, could you please silence the clock? The ticket really bothers her. It's not that severe. I'll be okay. No problem. It's standard policy. If there's anything at all that makes you uncomfortable, just let me know. Fuck that clock. Thank you. Huh. I guess that explains the ones in the house. Just a bit longer. They'll be calling for you soon. God damn it, the clock wasn't bothering me, son. Son, what? I found the clock. The clock is a memento. How do I get down? There I go. Hey, waitress. You're not a waitress. What am I talking about? I guess I don't know what the hell I'm talking about, actually, when I'm really thinking about it. Hey, I went through the ball. Why are there multiple U's? Tony Atwood. I'm going to talk to the doctor. Nope, can't talk to the doctor. I'm going to go over here. That's a bed. Apparently he sleeps in his own room. His own office. I'm going to touch the lamp. I'm going to touch this. I'm going to touch everything. I don't know what the fuck's going on. I'm going to touch that. I'm going to touch this. What if I go outside? Can't go outside. Alright. I'm going to touch this. I'm going to talk to the John again because apparently I don't know what the fuck is going on. Alright, I am completely lost now. I, where do I find the other mementos? I'm pushing spacebar on everything. Blarg! A plant Tawny Hannah bag. Really? Okay. Well, I touched another handbag. Didn't do anything. Rubble, rubble. 
a stuffed toy platypus. I can't believe this piece of atrocity is dated all the way back here. Looks like someone took good care of it. She's still got pretty bad taste in animals, though. Okay, we're out of here. Boop. So she has a mental illness. Interesting. But why her obsession with the moon? I can't even remember half this crap. But it's kind of sad. It's, it's really kind of sad. Then we go this way. And then we go this way. And then I fucked it up. Then we go this way. Then we go this way, and 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 I don't know what the fuck I just did. Then we go this way, and 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 then we go this way. I've already gone 15 times, and I go this way, and then I go this way, and then I go this way, and then I go this way. And then I go this way, and then I go this way, and then I go this way, and this way, and this way, and this way. Ha <laughs> ha! It only took me 25 tries. I'd say I am the best around. No one's ever going to bring me down. Psst, look. I know, I can't believe he once paid to see this crap in theater. No, you idiot. Look, we leaped. Now he a little kid. Nope, he's a teenager. Holy overcooked macaroni, the kid's in the theater all by himself. What a loser. You go to the theater by yourself all the time. That's different. No one's competent enough to match my taste. But that aside, how could anyone last through this rubbish? Are you British? Why would you use rubbish? Ain't nobody sitting next to me. I'm gonna go this way. Well, nobody showed up. I guess I'll leave the theater now. And thus, this movie sucks on both physical and metaphysical levels. Q-E-D. Come on, let's go. What? Oh, right. Talk to everybody. Kid, what are you doing? Why are you on the floor? Whoa, wait. I ain't talking to no emo teenager. Oh, that's a boy. Grammar, my dear Watson. Shut up. That's not even a full sentence. Let's just go look for mementos. I see I'm talking to no emo teenager. Gosh, I'm so mad, bro. Go into the girls' bathroom, go into the boys' bathroom. Pretty sure I got that backwards. Probably why I'm not allowed in the girls' bathroom. <laughs> for other reasons other than obvious. That's a ghost that's gone. That's a ghost that's gone. We're killing the ghosts! What are you doing? That's the third person you've removed here. Eh, not like it's permanent. Eh, uh, fuck you. Now, uh, fuck you. Go fuck yourself. Go away. You know that poking them out of the way like that does nothing, right? Then why complain? Then go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Sir, I'd like some popcorn, if you please. You won't give me no popcorn, because this theater sucks. Why don't you give me any popcorn? And you go away. It looks like an emo teenager. King stood up. Now that's a Kodak moment. You were late with, well, with your kin, I see. You go away. You go away. Oh, look. This place is all empty and creepy now. I hope you're happy. Very. I feel at home. 
the hell was that? Well, there's nothing here. I hate to say it, but I guess I had to nag something out of him again. All yours. At least there's no alls this time. He got stood up, bruh. That's so sad. Oh? River? You were in there this whole time? I waited for you at the lobby. I thought you didn't come. Why did you leave? I thought we were watching the movie together. Huh? I'm the one who should ask that. What do you mean? We were watching the movie together and then you left. We weren't watching it together. I didn't even know where you were. If you saw me in there, why didn't you come and find me? What difference does it make? We were watching the same movie in the same room. Ha 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 ha! What's wrong? You're so weird. Do you not want to watch the movie together anymore? Of course I do. Come, let's head back in before it ends. Oh, that's adorable. And that's how they got together. I feel like I should make a clever remark. You feel wrong. Well, let's hope our ride's waiting for us in there. And back in we go. Pop this guy out of existence. Nope, can't pop that guy out of existence. I'm gonna pop you. Pop you. Papu. Papu, papu. It's the platypus! <laughs> the fucking platypus is everywhere! Actually, we're going to end this episode here. So leave a like and a comment if you enjoy. Subscribe. Come over for a minute today. I'll see you everywhere. No, not everywhere. <laughs> I'll see you in the next episode, whatever it makes. Stay awesome, my friends. Cheers.